Now, Central Oregon's local alert weather with Chief Meteorologist Bob Shaw. Welcome to Friday. We've just turned 22 minutes before the hour. The Upper Deschutes Watershed Council announced a series of six lectures to inform public about uh, Wychus Creek and its watershed. Speakers will talk about the area's history, <clears throat> excuse me, native fish, water conservation, and restoration efforts. Uh, the first one is in February on the 15th at 5.30 p.m. at the Sisters Library. Pre-registration is required. You can find a list of other dates and a link on how to sign up on our website in the community billboard section. Well, good morning, everyone. We're waking up to a, a pretty nice morning here. Nice, clear skies and temperatures that uh, reflect the clear skies overnight. 25 degrees at the Bend Airport. Now, we have just the right recipe in stock. Clear skies, freezing or below temperatures, calm winds, and high humidity. That's the recipe you need for frost on the windshield and it's very similar all across Central Oregon. This is, these are the current conditions at the Redmond Airport, so give yourself a little extra time to contend with all of that. Well, we have a lot of cold air descending out of Canada across our plain states. We're getting some snow showers in uh, the Dakotas and points south and uh, it is that cold air is running into a lot of warm wet air right along the Gulf Coast. Now I'll give you an idea of how cold it is descending down through here. The pink that you're seeing in uh, right at, along the uh, Louisiana shoreline that's snow mixing in with some of that. We have just about the exact opposite here in the West. High pressure building in off the Pacific. It's allowing a, a few clouds into our area. And today we're going to live with this northerly flow around that high pressure. And consequently, you'll see temperatures today that'll be a little bit cooler than yesterday. We're staying above average, but they we won't get much above the mid to upper 40s. Tomorrow, that's going to change. We're going to be able to mix a little bit of warmer air, fairer conditions into this, and we'll keep the sunshine, just bump the temperatures up a little bit, and then we'll do that again on Sunday. By Sunday, we'll be in the mid-50s, and that's where we're going to stay for a couple of days. Right now, most of us are in the 20s. It is 19 in Sun River and 35 in Warm Springs. And uh, we are not seeing a great deal of wind right now, nor will we throughout the course of the day. If you get much breeze at all, it's going to be pretty gentle and generally coming out of the south. For the temperatures around the high desert, we'll be scattered through the 40s. If we hit that 45, 49, that is, at the Roberts Field, that's about five degrees above average right now. And from here, it only gets warmer. Well, these clear skies will allow for some cold nights. Uh, tonight, we'll be in the mid-teens to mid-20s for overnight lows. And uh, we just get warmer from here. We'll be in the low 50s Saturday and mid-50s by Sunday. Tons of sunshine in the forecast. Uh, we are not used to this kind of weather this time of year. Uh, it would be much nicer if we had snow for everyone, but that's not the case for the next several days.